What are checks and balances? Checks and balances refer to a fundamental principle of government design in which the powers of different branches or institutions are deliberately distributed and balanced to prevent any one branch or individual from gaining excessive power or becoming tyrannical. This system is intended to ensure that each branch of government can monitor and influence the actions of the others, thus creating a system of accountability and restraint. Checks and balances are an integral part of many democratic systems and are essential for safeguarding individual rights and maintaining the rule of law. In a system of checks and balances, the powers and functions of the government are divided into distinct branches. The three main branches of government in many democratic countries are. Here's how the principle of checks and balances work. Legislative check on the executive. The legislative branch can check the executive branch's power by approving or rejecting appointments, treaties, and budgets. It can also impeach the president or other executive officials for misconduct. Legislative check on the judicial. The legislative branch can influence the judicial branch by confirming or rejecting judicial appointments and amending laws if it disagrees with judicial interpretation. Executive check on the legislative. The executive branch can veto bills passed by the legislature, preventing them from becoming law unless the veto is overridden by a legislative supermajority. Executive check on the judicial, the executive branch enforces court decisions and can pardon individuals convicted of crimes. Judicial check on the legislative and executive, the judicial branch can declare laws or executive actions unconstitutional, thereby invalidating them if they violate the constitution. Judicial check on itself, the judicial branch can review and overturn previous court decisions if it deems them to be incorrect or unconstitutional. These checks and balances prevent any one branch from becoming too powerful and allow for a system of mutual accountability. They require cooperation and negotiation among the branches and ensure that no single entity can dominate the government.